Good morning everybody. So this morning Natalie and I are going on the three waterfall tour. There's lots of other bits. I will insert here the itinerary of our day to day. So we had to come down for breakfast at 7.45 and we're being picked up at quarter past eight. Really looking forward to today. My toe is completely covered so hopefully any dirt will stay out of it. Right, off we go. Another day of exploring. Just arrived at the first waterfall and we've got 50 minutes here. Hello. <laughs> there are some beautiful flowers along the way here. Wow, here we go, walking down to a waterfall. And I can just see it out the corner of my eye. It looks very nice. There's also like a go-kart thing here as well, which you can have a go on, which I might if we get time. Made it to the first waterfall. Wow, these are beautiful. When your tour guide thinks you're too slow, so he carries your bags for you. <laughs> Arrived and I've just been told it's a 200 meter walk to the waterfalls. A little bit of information for you. Dilat is the second highest place in Vietnam. The first being Sapa and I went to Sapa last year so don't forget to check out the video. I will leave the link up here for you. 200 meters, I think it's 200 meters straight down. But if you want to, you can pay and they can bring you back up in an electric car. <laughs> I don't know whether you can actually see from that how steep it is. And when you come down, what you got to do? Turn around and come back up afterwards. This should be fun. So these are the largest waterfalls that we will visit today. And I have to say, looking at this, it was well worth the climb down and then again back up those stairs. It's very uneven, but wow. You want to have a look, don't you? Shall I show you? Go on then. Vietnamese health and safety. So some people are having lunch here. Yay, go me! 210 stairs, I counted. And now we're off. It's about a 30 minute ride back on the bus and we are heading up for a traditional lunch, which is included in the price of the tour. And I will put the price of the tour in here. So far, I'm really enjoying it. The two waterfalls that we've been to already have been really nice. Feeling a little rushed, but on the whole, it's been good. Stopping here for a local lunch. Goodness, we've got a good view here. This is our table. And this is my main course. It's chicken with fries and salad and a sauce. 
right at the final waterfall, which is called the Elephant Waterfall. Oh my word, these are such powerful waterfalls. It is literally wow. Well done, Natalie. Hello. <laughs> I think I'm just going to watch from here. <laughs> it's way too slippery in my flip flops with the gammy toe. <laughs> Arrived at the Big Lady Buddha, and evidently you can go up as far as the shoulders, and there are 254 stairs to get to the top. It's just so hot, and I'm so sweaty. I'm not sure I'm going to make it. I'll give it a go and see how high I get. Here we go, 250. I think this is the last one up there. There's an update on the stair count, 257. I'm hot, I'm stinky, I'm sweaty, <laughs> I need a shower. <laughs> Go me, I made it. <laughs> 257 stairs. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So now we're headed to the Happy Buddha. <laughs> I know someone whose nickname is the Happy Buddha. Hello if you're watching. <laughs> There we go, the Happy Buddha. We've come to a silk factory. The cocoon, you can see the lava inside. We've just arrived at a cricket farm. I think this must be rice wine. This is what I was expecting. These crickets are small crickets and they don't jump or fly. Ginseng wai. This is the corn wai. Vietnamese traditional rice wine. So we're going to try banana wine and other wine and something else wine. And we've got snacks. What's this? Rice? This is sticky rice wine. Cheers. Yeah, that was okay. Ginseng wine. Yeah, crispy. That's crispy. Where's the ginseng? Bottoms up. Yeah, actually, it was all right. <laughs> right at the last stop of the day, which is a coffee shop.
this is weasel poo, which is coffee poo poo. <laughs> So now I'm going to head through here to go and see the weasels. Now you can go past and you can smell the coffee. So these are the regular ones and these are the weasel ones here and this is the prices of them underneath. Decided not to taste the coffee today just because it's quite late in the day and I already have trouble sleeping and I don't want anything to disturb my sleep tonight. This is a foldable backpack. Look at that. Wow, those are so cool. And, and it actually opens from the back as well, so all your stuff is secure inside. That is. And have a pocket here. Wow. Very cool. Look at those clouds. It looks like the rain's just about to set in. My roundup of today. It's been a really nice tour. It's been a long day. Lots. Of... Excuse me. It's been a really long day. Nice day. Wish I could have spent a little bit longer time at the waterfalls after all that walking down to them. It felt a little bit rushed. But the second half of the day after lunch, it's been really lovely. And the temperature's cooled down now as well. So everyone's just finishing off their coffee and then we're gonna head back to the hostel. Yeah, I think I might just go back, have a shower and watch a movie before bed. I hope you enjoyed this day out in Dalat. And tomorrow I'm going to have a day of organising my onward travel because I'm going to head down to Ho Chi Minh.